Uh, but listen, folks, it is time for our mailbag. We Every week we ask you guys, well, now it's every day, to write in your questions. You can send your questions to us at amcmovietalk at gmail.com. Send those to us, and we'll get to one or two every day. Today we're going to do two. So Gigi has a couple picked up from the mailbag. So what do we got? Well, our first letter comes from Anthony T, and he writes, Hi, I found your channel on YouTube, and I've been a fan ever since. It's great to hear you guys talk about all the movie news daily. My question is, do you predict a Batman cameo in the Man of Steel credits, and do you think, or who do you think should play uh, the next Dark Knight for the JLA and 2007 reboot? Um... No, I, I don't think we're going to see uh, a cameo appearance in the Man of Steel for a couple reasons. One, Man of Steel's done shooting. They're done. And they have not picked out their new Batman. I mean, they may have intellectually figured out who their next Batman's going to be, but they haven't really picked him out yet. I don't think so. And 2017, four years away. So if I had, so number one, no, I don't think we're going to see a cameo. And if I had to pick somebody now, four years away, two guys come to mind. One guy is Army Hammer who's going to be the Lone Ranger in the upcoming movie, who, oddly enough, when they tried to get a Justice League movie going a bunch of years ago, Army Hammer was going to be Bruce Wayne slash Batman in that, oddly enough, before he ever became big in the social network. The other guy I would go with, after seeing Bullet to the Head, and Dan knows where I'm going with this, I, I want to see Jason Momoa. I want to see Jason Momoa as, as Batman. I, I think he's huge. He's physical. Finally, look, I, all due respect to Christian Bale, who was great as Batman. I don't want a Batman that I can kick the crap out of, okay? I want a big, giant, menacing, dark knight, and that's Jason Momoa. So, Dan, what about you? What do you think? I, I you know, I cannot possibly agree with you more about Jason Momoa. I think Really? That is, I'm actually a little surprised. <laughs> Awesome. Oh, my God. Thousand percent. You you know, this might be the only time this happens. But <laughs> I a thousand percent agree with you because he has the acting chops. He has the physicality and he has that dark edge that if yeah. they're willing to go kind of an edgy way with the Justice League, if they're not trying to go, you know, soft, as long as they'll go as long as they're willing to go edgy and hard. Thousand percent. I think he'd be great. And I also agree the likelihood of a, of a cameo is pretty is pretty small for Man of Steel. But if they manage to pull it off, you know, a la the Avengers final after the credits sequence, it would be the hugest surprise ever. Because like you say, the movie isn't, you know, is, is another four years away. So if the studio somehow manages to pull that off, it'll be amazing. But yeah, I, I wouldn't I, drop I wouldn't drop out of shock if they had a cameo. I just don't think it'll be Bruce Wayne slash Batman. Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, if you like this video, make sure to stop what you're doing and subscribe to our AMC Theaters YouTube channel to keep up to date on all the movie news, editorials, and our AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter to hear about all our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.